What's going on my friends? Welcome to the good old backcountry roads of Haines City and Lake Wales and Davenport. Well, Davenport's a little bit more uh, built up, but this is, uh, we're approaching the Lake Hamilton unprotected left. So right now I think we're on uh, Country Road 546 or something. I gotta figure out what it's actually called. I had just seen it earlier. It's, uh, yeah, State Road 546 East to 27. We're navigating to Floridino's Italian Kitchen. So just in case anybody's been around this area and wants to see what this is like, uh, we got some traffic. So hopefully this will be a good test now for this unprotected left. <laughs> I told you on the last video, the scenery is gonna be a lot different for the Cyberlift channel. So here we go. This is actually surprising to see earlier. Uh, and it branches off and the system incorrectly was getting into the right lane here. Oh, is it doing it right this time? Yes, good job. Yeah, earlier when I took this left, it got us in this right lane. We gotta take a left here. Oh boy, yeah, look at all these cars flying by. So this is State Road 27. It's basically a, a highway in a lot of ways. Um, cars are gonna be traveling anywhere from 55 to 65 miles an hour, or about uh, 89 to 105 kilometers an hour. And yeah, we're gonna see how this goes. I don't know if this will always be an unprotected left. It looks like it might be getting changed to a light here soon. So we'll enjoy this while we can. Looks like the wiring's already in place for some traffic lights. Probably because of this road and how crazy it can get. So as soon as the Silverado in front of us goes, we'll take off. I was actually just watching Stephen Mark Ryan's video recapping Tucker Carlson's video of the Cybertruck with a gentleman in Maine who's using it for, you know, working on a farm, hauling stuff. If you haven't seen Tucker's video on X, just look up Tucker Carlson's Cybertruck and you'll see it. Uh, Cybertruck in Maine. Or look up Stephen Mark Ryan on his channel. He put out a video kind of cutting out a lot of the irrelevant stuff so it's a little bit faster to watch. But yeah, really cool. I'm sending it to my dad and everyone out here who uses trucks. Um, Florida's probably a lot more country than a lot of y'all realize. Uh, people who live here know. So it'll be those kinds of videos of farmers and such using Cybertruck that'll really show people like, oh, this isn't just some toy, this is real. Now I might have to actually inch forward. This this guy can't even go. This is showing us just how nutty this might be. Now I will be ready to get on the throttle to not miss an opportunity because we're holding, we got a bunch of cars behind us. This is a very busy UPL. All right, we're creeping up, we're creeping up, we're creeping up. We are wide open on the left. We need to go. We are not open on the right. Oh, but we're going full send. Okay. Oh, <laughs> G-Force. Woo, let's get it. All right, we had a mob of cars coming up behind us, but it was wide open on this side. So in, in future videos, I'll check this out more. I'm going to take over so we don't actually go into Floridino's Italian kitchen. Um, I want to do designated videos sampling this test, but you can see the kind of road this is and how wide it is. And I think this is a U-turn point here. So I'm going to take this to, to get back because I got stuff to do at home and all. Uh, but we're going to do a lot more videos of this. This is a quick kind of teaser clip of the UPL that I found that I'll be trying. And 27 is full of them. I mean, Florida itself is full of them. But this wide and busy with this many cars at this speed, I'm excited to show everybody what's going on. Especially when you've got a lot more cars going. But this is exciting. All right, I'm gonna head back home and get back to doing some chores. I think tomorrow morning I'm gonna give the cars a wash and we'll get uh, spooling up on the content. Thank you all for tuning in and I'll catch you in the next one.